viewers this is uday kumar sahu uh, department of electronics and communication engineering and staff of sensory university of technology and management i am here uh, to represent today a uh, e vehicle that has developed by our mechanical and electrical students graduate students for the students under the guidance of our president uh, dr professor muktikant misra and uh, the main uh, thing over here that uh, under the slogan we are working uh, waste to wealth and uh, our students uh, their uh, with their restless day night effort they achieved all those things and uh, i request to pratik to say something what is experience and what is the application of this uh, vehicle how it is different from other vehicle uh, so that's why i'm i'm requesting to pratik pratik uh, please uh, explain something about this uh, initiative hello friends this is the project we did under the guidance of our chairman sir dr professor mukti kanta mishra when sir when sir gave us the project uh, sir gave us five objectives sir's primary objective was to make this car go around 35 kilometers per hour Uh, make this car more stable compared to the other vehicles of other e vehicles of the college make it uh, rain proof heat proof and other things make it more comfortable as compared to the other vehicles and the most important thing which he emphasized was to make it pollution free was to make it an e vehicle so this is our project major project an e vehicle so we have we have taken a combustion engine vehicle we have removed everything Uh, uh this is a part of the waste to wealth initiative under century university everything you see here has been made from scrap for example i'll show you here so this is the this is the kind of things we have used so this whole concept this body this this part this part and here have been made from scrap so we have used this scrap we have and even the seats which you see the students are sitting on uh, is was a part of scrap it was from we got it from storehouse uh so that so the next part is the technical technical details about this car so my my teammate somnath will give you a brief description about it first of all greeting to all the viewers i am going to explain you what are the what is actually waste to wealth we bought this car as a scrap so in order to build build this to a convert this to a electric vehicle the things which we had which we keep is that this is the suspension which we is as which we retained and this is the bonnet and apart from this we kept the only chassis apart from that we manufacture this everything by using mostly the scrap materials apart from that the manufacturing processes which we took is this one is a bit curved and this curved has been made by using uh, the grinding grinding machine using the cutting wheel we just cut the edges and we just bend after this 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 was the completely covered the body from the motor itself and we used gas cutting technique which is which is a combination of oxygen and acetylene using those two who gas we cut this entire body and we separated the top portion and the bottom so apart from that these are the 25 into 50 cross uh, specification pipes and these are cut using the cutters and we use other manufacturing processes like welding which is more specifically arc welding and uh, grinding rimming put, uh, we applied primer so that it can be dust coated and we retained the brakes and apart from this coming to the technical point of view this is a electric vehicle and this is the only vehicle which runs using the front differential in our campus we already have three vehicles and this is the one which have only the front wheel drive and for to demonstrate that this is the differential which this is the differential one and this one is the drive axle both has been coupled with the help of the welding technique and this is the only vehicle as per my knowledge exist because the the problem with this electric vehicles are that they come in the coupling with the motor and differential they cu couple together and the problem with our was the wheel diameter is a big bigger one so we brought the drive axle and we made it we made it two parts and make this work properly and successfully and after that in order to specify the other technical details like how controller motor differential works i would like to invite my friend jakesh ranjan sahu to demonstrate i am jakesh uh, from mechanical and i uh, now i am going to uh, brief about the technical specifications uh, here we are using the brushless dc motor of 1 kilowatt and 48 volt and it give the 3000 revolution per minute and uh, about the battery we are using 48 volt means uh, a four battery of 12 volt and 100 ampere hour it's total 48 volt and 400 ampere hour 
and uh, the vehicle range is uh, 80 to 100 km per charge in fully load and uh, the suspension and steering system that all the all the part have the vehicle before driving shaft is of the uh, same car and the controller of the uh, specification of 48 volt and uh, 100 ampere the top speed of 35 km per hour and it's a uh, six seater means uh, maximum to 1000 kg this project we conceived when we are talking one day how to convert west to wealth and uh, this six young kids they said that we want to do a project on that and that's how uh, we had the preliminary discussion and they came up with a huge plan and that plan was to make a bigger vehicle then we decided that we'll make it smaller and see how it can be functional and whatever the product they come out the university must be able to use it to use for all weather purpose and for all sorts of functions of the university carrying material carrying people it's like a golf cart come with a shed which it has so that it doesn't get drenched in the rain so that's how the project was conceived and they did a fantastic job they showed me the model and they slowly built it step by step and I'm very glad that they have come to this stage but I want to be more glad and most glad to go to the next level and they have to make it ready in next couple of weeks it's about three to four weeks that if somebody comes and sees in the market will say that wow I want to buy it and then if succeed in that we will launch a company which will manufacture this to sell it in various NACs, municipalities, gram panchayats and this kind of, uh, you know, at a cheaper, affordable way. And this because these vehicles will not have any emission. This vehicle will run up to 30 km speed. So that is perfect for rural uh, landscape. So we are trying to set up or create a company. And that company will be the front for all the student projects in the future, so far as the automobile aspect of the mechanical engineering or electrical engineering or gross sections of engineering departments, they create a product. That's all.